Marilyn Mosby's federal trial has been delayed. It was supposed to start on Monday. WMER 2 News' Kendall Green is live outside the courthouse in downtown Baltimore. So, Kendall, what prompted the judge to make this decision? Hey, Kelly and Mallory, it's a change of tune for federal prosecutors and state's attorney Mosby's case. And the delay today is centered all around a key witness that the uh, prosecutors filed the motion to eliminate. Now, uh, the witness, Mr. Schmidt, is a, at the heart of state's attorney Mosby's defense. The government claims her attorneys disclosed additional opinions from that witness well beyond the court imposed deadline. And that witness is prepared to shed more light on Ms. Mosby's financial status and how it is impacted by COVID-19. Now, prosecutors, though, now say they need more time to get an expert to prepare and cross-examine that witness. It's worth noting, though, they originally stated they didn't need experts at all, according to attorney Scott Bowden. Now, Judge Grisby ultimately upheld that motion for continuance. She says she made the ruling regretfully, telling those in the courtroom, we are where we are. Now, Mr. Smith's testimony would offer context regarding business and travel, shedding light on the financial and economic impact on Mahogany Elite. That's state's attorney's travel-related business, which they say suffered hardship stemming from COVID. Now, attorney uh, Scott Bowden maintains state's attorney's innocence and says whether the trial is today or Monday, She's prepared. The government, as part of their gamesmanship and continued prosecution, I'm sorry, persecution, now wants a continuance because they realize that we have some incredible experts to defend her. And they've told us repeatedly they didn't want experts, they didn't need experts, and now on the eve of trial, they report to the court on the record that they're going to use experts. All right? If I could curse, I'd tell you it was all bull. Right? Now, there is a pretrial hearing again scheduled for tomorrow starting at 2 p.m. There we'll learn the outline and the timeline of where things will go. And, of course, with witnesses, well, not witnesses, but jurors, they were starting to be partially sequestered, but now that has been halted. We'll bring you more developments uh, later on tonight and tomorrow as far as this pretrial hearing is concerned. But for now, reporting in downtown Baltimore, Kendall Green, WMER2 News. And on the same